The Maya Biosphere Reserve Spanish, Reserva de la Biosfera Maya is a nature reserve in Guatemala managed by Guatemala's National Council of Protected Areas the Maya Biosphere Reserve covers an area of 21,602 square kilometers. The park is home to a large number of species of fauna, including Morelitz crocodile and the oscillated turkey. It is also rich in flora, including breadnut, mahogany, Sweetenia humilis, Bloma prisca, Vitex gomeri, cedar, Buchita buceras, Hematoxylum campechinum, Rhizophora mangle, and Pimenta dioica. The area ranges from wetlands to low mountain ranges and has several bodies of water, including lakes, rivers, streams, and cenotes. The reserve was created in 1990 to protect the largest area of American tropical forest remaining north of the Amazon. The Biosphere Reserve model, implemented by UNESCO, seeks to promote a balance between human activities and the biosphere by including sustainable economic development in conservation planning. <laughs> human activity The Maya Biosphere Reserve is divided into several zones, each with a different protected status. The core zones are formed by several national parks and biotopes wildlife preserves, in which no human settlement, logging, or extraction of resources are allowed. These include Laguna del Tigre National Park, Sierra del Lacandon National Park, Mirador Rio Azul National Park, Tikal National Park, El Zotz Biotope, Noctan dos Lagunas Biotope, Cerro Cui Biotope, Laguna del Tigre Biotope, and El Pilar Natural Monument. The core zones cover an area of 7670 square kilometers, which is 36% of the Maya Biosphere Reserve in multiple use zones, 8484.40 square kilometers, 40%, and the buffer zone, 4975 square kilometers, 24%, which comprises the southern portion of the reserve. Certain regulated economic activities are allowed. These include the sustainable harvesting of wood and traditional forest products which include chicle, a sap used in the manufacture of chewing gum, exate, an ornamental palm plant used in floral arrangements, and pimenta or allspice. The Guatemalan government has granted forest concessions to local communities, giving them the right to practice sustainable forestry in delineated areas for 25 years. International monitoring groups such as the Forest Stewardship Council certify logging activities as sustainable. In 2005, 4500 square kilometers, 1700 square miles were certified. In other parts of the multiple use zone, farming communities have been granted the right to continue farming in so-called agricultural polygons. Topic: Archaeology. The Maya Biosphere Reserve is home to a large concentration of ancient Maya cities, many of which are under excavation. Tikal is the most famous of these, attracting about 120,000 to 180,000 visitors per year. The Mirador Basin, in the northern part of the reserve, contains numerous interconnected Maya cities. The project is directed by Richard Hansen, an archaeologist at El Mirador, the largest of the sites, dating from the pre-classic Maya period. Other cities in the region include El Tintal, Nakbi, and Wakna. Environmental threats Ecosystems in Maya Biosphere Reserve face numerous threats from human activities, including illegal logging, farming, and ranching in protected areas, as well as drug trafficking, poaching, and looting of Maya artifacts. 
The forest area of the reserve has shrunk by 13% over the last 21 years according to the non-profit organization Rainforest Alliance, which has several community development projects in the region. Since 2000, illegal cattle ranches have cleared about 8% of the reserve. Some of the most extreme deforestation has occurred in the Laguna del Tigre and Sierra del Lancandon National Parks. <laughs> 